Hey guys, Tim Wilson UK here and welcome back to another episode of Playing with Ghosts on the Golf Club and as you can see we're playing Baccarat Golf Club today and I'm going to be playing around with the two Jerry's. I did notice this one when I uh, logged on and I saw that Jerry Lee had played this, Jerry Lee 63, so we're going to drop him in the game. We're also going to drop the other Jerry in there, Jerry N220, he played this 12 weeks ago. Um, and let's get straight into the round. Now, apologies if this doesn't sound great from an audio perspective. I have gone back to my Razer headset, which I normally use when I'm playing online with friends, purely because of the fact that the sound quality doesn't really matter. Um, I was using my Turtle Beach headset to record videos up until today, but I've been told by somebody in the comments on my YouTube videos that there is some slight crackling on there and I think it's the cable that goes from the um, the little block on the cable to the handset to the controller that is faulty because I changed the controller and I still got the crackle so I'm back on the Razer headset for the time being I have pulled the mouthpiece away from my mouth quite significantly and I am using a new controller, and that is not a great start. <laughs> oh my goodness, what a start. First shot with a new controller, and I'm in the drink. So this is going to be my second shot. Wow. And that one's 96%. Oh, are we going to catch the fairway? Just. So my next shot will be for par. Yeah, so I am using the, uh, I'm back on the Razer controller, so I hope this doesn't sound too bad, guys. Um, I will probably look at investing in a new controller fairly shortly, but for the time being, this one will have to do. And not a new controller, a new headset. Um, I'm hoping that's going to roll up a bit and I can pick up a bogey. That will do. If I only had done that the first time round. So that's going to be a bogey on the first hole. Yeah, plus one. And Jerry also got a bogey. So, uh, wow. None of us got off to a great start there. So I am sticking with the new controller because it, um, it does feel really good. And I needed to change it. The thumbstick was wearing out a little bit where I played a lot of the golf club. There is a sort of nail indentation in the in the left thumbstick, so I was due a new controller, but I will need to invest in a new headset, I think. That's more like it, 100%. Where are we going? I would imagine we're going off to the left now. Uh, flag's going to be off to the left up the hill. Yeah. Right, we still got 11 feet, 143 plus 11, 154. The good thing about this Razer headset is that the sound quality through the actual headset itself is absolutely perfect. So what I'm hearing is brilliant. The game sound is awesome I just hope it sounds great for you guys coming through the microphone all right back to level par and Jerry's in for uh, for birdie as well so he's back to level par and it looks like Jerry Lee's gonna bogey this so we've sort of swapped around there we've both birdied it he's uh, he's bogeyed it so we're back to uh, Jerry N220 and, and myself are back to level par. 11 off of uh, 160 minus 11, 149. Is it going to have enough to get there? It is just, but it's nowhere near close enough. Jerry Lee stuck it right next to the hole. Oh, he just missed his birdie. Yeah, 
It's not a bad attempt from where I was. And we're all in for par, all at exactly the same time. Right, so we're looking at the gross scores here because uh, we're not going to take handicaps into account when we're doing the playing with ghosts. When I went into the water off the first tee, I didn't expect to be in the position I am now. I thought the guys would be running away with it, but looks like Jerry N220 has just drifted off the fairway into the rough, so he's going to have a a tough job getting to the green in two, or getting it close. Let's see where he ended up. Yeah, he's gone in the bunker now as well. So, not a great hole for him. But I'm pretty sure he'll be able to get it up and down for par. Excuse me. Need that to bite. The greens aren't that fast. They're 172 which is a nice change considering I'm used to playing 187 greens. That was a nice putt. Jerry's got a tough one here now for trying to salvage his par. Let me just check out the comments. Alright, so looks like uh, Kieran's watching, so welcome along my friend. Thank you for joining the channel and joining the community on Twitch. Let's get this par 5 underway. Right, this is going to be a tough one to try and reach in two because we have these trees on the right hand side of the fairway. But we need to try and stick to the right to open up the green on the second shot. So I'm going to try and pull this around the trees and get it over to the right hand side of the fairway. Best laid plans and all that, I can't see that that might work out because it's still going off to the right. Are we going to be able to see the green? That's the... Hmm. Not so much. I'm going to have to come around the trees I think. That worked out pretty well. <coughs> Excuse me. As long as that slows up now, we should be putting for an eagle. It's not a long par 5, but it's a tough one because of the tree locations and the way the fairway moves. Right, Jerry's put his pretty close. A little bit too much backspin. Jerry N220, that is. 32 feet, 1 inch uphill. I've hit that too hard and left. Okay, should be able to pick up the birdie from there. Wasn't overly... I thought I'd hit it way too fast, but I didn't hit it overly bad. Oh, Jerry Lee, unfortunate there. He almost picked up a birdie. Alright, so just gone to two under now, so going along nicely. Short par four, not reachable as the crow as the crow flies. So need to just make sure we get this right in the middle of the fairway, get it past the bend, which it looks like we've done. Massive dog leg to the right, almost 90 degrees here. So this shouldn't be. I was going to say it shouldn't be more than about 170, 160 plus eight, 168. Let's take a little off of this. See if we can put this right next to the flag. Hit it nicely. Is it going to come back a little with the wind? Not so much. A bit strong as well. Should check up okay though. It's a fairly short iron. Jerry Lee nailed his birdie. Nice shot there. Oh yes, just grabs it on the left edge. Moves to three under par. So. After that opening bogey where we ended up in the water, I've got four birdies in five holes. So really starting to feel the rhythm now getting into it. 
fairly short par 5 again, 530 yards. 99% power, not great off the tee to be fair, but it should be enough. 270, 280, so we're going to have still 250 to the flag. It is reachable, I feel. Ninety-seven, absolutely pants. Well, that's okay. Not that bad. None of the boys managed to get theirs in, so let's see if we can get this nice and close. Fifteen yards. Wind swirling a bit here. Bite. That's okay. That's going to be about two feet for a birdie. Okay. Five birdies in six holes. Par three, a lot downhill. 61 feet. So that's 20 yards. 136. Ninety five per cent. Shocking. Not gonna be anywhere near in fact Ooh, man, I am having a water filled round today. <laughs> That's twice I've got in the water. Need to get this in to salvage par. So that's going to be a bogey. Still need to get this in. Five feet. And that's for bogey. So that's going to bring me back to two under. So struggling a little bit with a new controller. Trying to get to grips with this new not worn down left thumbstick. So it might take me a little bit longer. I may have a few more of the 95 percenters. But uh, let's see how we get on. That's better, 100%. Made sure the character sort of froze his motion at the top of his backswing just to ensure that I was going to get that 100%. This is a relatively short par 4. Stroke index 4. Must be the green because I can't see that being that difficult. Why is that a stroke index 4? Especially when you can fire in there with a pitching wedge. And that putt's not difficult at all. So, got a bogey and then picked it straight back up with the birdie on the next hole. So even though that entire call, or that entire front round is filled with yellow, there is a couple of bogeys in there as well, which is disappointing. Let's have a quick look at the comments while those guys tee off. Whoops, we don't want to do that. There we go. You're welcome, mate. What game is that? This is the golf club. So if you're ever looking for an absolutely cracking game for the PS4 or the Xbox One or the PC, it's available on all of those formats. But I would hold off if you're thinking of getting a golf game because in just over a month's time, the Golf Club 2 will be coming out. So I would uh, I'd hold fire for the time being. I'm going to pitch this because I think I should be able to get this to bite on these greens. Let's hope anyway. I need one bounce and I need it to bite. It didn't bite. Ah, That's going to give me a tough putt now.
managed to get it nonetheless. We're in for birdie. Where are we score wise? So Jerry Lee's pulled it back round. He's now three under. Jerry N221 under, and I am at five under. So I need to make sure I don't make any more stupid errors and get any more bogeys. Another nice drive, that felt good. Alright, got a fair distance to go here, 185. Hit that nice and straight, is it going to have the legs? It looks like it is. Ooh, that wasn't far off actually being in the hole. Yes, myself and Jerry Lee bo a birdied again. Did he birdie? He did birdie. He's gone to four under par. Right, we have a par five. Let's put this in the middle of the fairway. Really pausing at the top of the backswing just to make sure I get the 100% here. Need to make sure I get this as far down the fairway on the tee shot as possible to give myself the best opportunity at hitting the green in two. That's a little right, but whoops. God, that rendering was all weird there. I'm hoping it's going to slow down and not go up that hill. It has gone up the hill. Now I need it to run out because I do not want that putt coming back. Run out. Oh, thank God, it's just run off. Oh, that I was so worried that wasn't going to run off. I was dreading that putt. almost slam dunked into the hole there and look it spun back a good 10 feet that has 12 feet not a lot of movement on this is there any movement at all if you're not sure hit it hard enough to take the break out of the putt so that's in for a birdie on to seven under par. Both of the other two guys clean up there for their pars. Alright, got 180. That is pretty much bang on the money. Nice and straight again. Hit the flag. Ooh, rolls over the edge of the hole. And we all pretty much end up within two feet. You could throw a beach towel over the three balls there. Oh, nice putt, Jerry N220. What a putt. A little bit too hard. Took some of the break out of the putt. And we pick up a par and move on to hole number 14, five holes to play. And I think we can probably get this up there. I shank that. You could hear that straight away. This is going to be a tough hole now because that is going to run into the rough. As does Jerry N220s. This is going to be. Well, mind you, it's not that far. It's not that badly in the rough. We should be okay, actually. Oh, it came out thick, though. It's okay. It's ended up alright. It's not going to check up as nicely as I wanted it to because I was coming out of the rough. That's okay, it's going to be about 25 feet, the putt, by the looks of it. Oh, not as much as that, 16 feet. Anybody get a birdie? 
No. Turn, turn. Oh, that was close. Alright. In for par. Looks like Jerry Lee's going to bogey this one. Yeah, unfortunately he's just dropped a shot now. Right, 473-yard par 4. Once again, we've all pretty much teed it up and hit the ball in the same position. 197, 194. I don't know why I moved that off to the left, because that's a two mile an hour wind. It's barely going to make any difference at all, and it didn't there. Um, Got a wicked kick off to the left hand side, and that's why, because it hit that slope. Now, this is going to turn right at the end, so I'm just going to put it on the left hand side of the cup, and it should dive at the end. Now, oh, it dove just as it went past the hole, probably hit it a little too hard, but managed to pick up the par. So still sitting fairly comfortably in the lead at 7 under par at the moment. Where are we going here? 221 onto an sort of peninsula green here. 221, 218. Two, that's got to be the club. I'm hoping it's the club, otherwise it's going to be wet. And it wouldn't surprise me because I've had two balls in the water already today on this round and that's going to hold I think is it going to hold yes pretty pleased with that 200 yard shot on a par 3 to hold the green is always good news this is massively downhill so we don't want to go too far past the hole I think I've hit that too hard in fact I have hit it too hard there's no thinking about it that is way too hard wow as soon as I hit it, I knew this is going to be a tough par attempt here. No, nope, that's a bogey. So, as I was just saying, I've managed to stay in the lead and hold position at 7 under par. I then go and pick up a bogey on that hole. So, I've had three bogeys in this round, which is pretty poor, because I like to try and get bogey free rounds and it's not good when I get three bogeys in the same round so a little disappointed with myself there it's partly down to the controller but you know bad workman always blames his tools and all that I can't be too critical of the of the controller but it does take a little bit of getting used to for those of you that do console gaming you know that you get so used to playing with a particular controller when you change it or you replace it it does take a little while to get used to the new one and this is the first actual time I've used this controller it's not like it's the first time I'm using it on the golf club it's the first time out of the box that I'm using this controller wow Jerry N220 just sank a mean putt there Turn, turn, turn. A little bit more. No. Right, we're on the 17th hole. This has absolutely flown past these 18 holes. Seem like we've blitzed through them fairly smartish. So let's get into the final hole. It's a par 5. Is it a long one? No, 520 yards. So let's see whether we can take a driver off the tee here. I think we can. I don't think we're going to end up in there in the drink, I hope not at least. Didn't hit the tree which is good.
227. A little bit of wind. Let's try and take try and get this to hang up a little. Need that wind to straighten up. I don't think it's going to. It's going to be way, way long. Yeah, it's going to roll on. This is going to be a huge putt. And I think it's probably going to be downhill the way that that has turned round. Yeah, 27 feet, 5 inches downhill. It's going to be a horrible putt. I've got to be careful not to do what I did the last time and go way past the hole. So let's just get it moving and it should dribble down to the hole. Ah, oh, I've just completely done the opposite to what I did last time. So that was for eagle. This is for birdie. And that one I've missed as well. Ah, oh, Parring on a par 5 is almost as bad as getting a bogey. So that is a gross score of 6 under par, Jerry Lee 63 with a gross score of 4 under par and Jerry N220 with a gross of 2 under par. I thoroughly enjoyed that, I really enjoyed that course, it was nice, um, not the best I've played but it's a, it's a decent course, it's um, nothing too complicated, there were some tricky holes in there and um, yeah I was in the drink twice so not fantastic but six under par is under par nonetheless if you've been watching live on twitch thank you very much for tuning in guys if you are watching this on youtube and you enjoyed it then hit the like rating give us a thumbs up just to know that you just so i know that you guys enjoyed the video and that you appreciate me making the or taking the time to make the videos and if you'd like to leave some comments in the box below feel free to pop them in there and as I've said before, if you would like to add me as a friend on, if you do play this game on the PS4 and you'd like to send me a friend request so I can play against your ghost balls in the game and or live at any point in time, you can hook me up with an invitation and I'd be happy to play a live round of golf with you. Um, similarly, if you enjoyed this and you would like to see more like this, hit the subscribe button and you will, and also check the little bell icon next to the subscription button and you'll get notified when new videos come online when I post new videos on YouTube. But until next time, guys, thank you very much for watching. Once again, take care. Bye-bye.